Hey everyone, it's a special day today because I'm here with Black Friday! We finally oh, got to meet! Yeah, Black Friday! <laughs> We're gonna squish it! We didn't actually do this when we met. No, no. it was like, oh, I don't know, I was not, I was just in like a state. You were, you <laughs> I'm still in a state. Tired. Yeah. Oh my god, yeah, traveling is somehow exhausting even though what, we, what you're doing is sitting. I know, right? Time. Yeah, you're like, why should you be tired? <laughs> yeah, I think it's the recycled air as well. Oh yeah, it makes you feel like shit. Yeah, that's the bad okay. thing about banning smoking on airplanes. I guess now the air is like <sighs> awful. All right, I'm gonna eat a chip. I'm gonna also eat a chip. Mm. Our lunch is cold. I don't even care. It's I'm still good. It's oh, good. I'm hungry. Mm. What are we actually talking about? Well, this thing, I suppose. Okay. Or is it just general chit chat? General, but yeah, I've got some things I want to chat to you about to get like your first impressions. Okay. So this will be interesting. Mm. Um, so firstly, we just want to say thank you to everyone that has pre-ordered anything that we've been working on. There's like, yeah. hundreds of sales and it's lovely for me, it's lovely for you. Yeah, it's really, it's really cool to see people's photos on Instagram and stuff like holding the things. It's like, and they, they, they look really good, like they, they suit so many things and yeah. I don't, it's, a re, it's a really good feeling and uh, I just I hope everybody loves them. So Black Friday is actually holding the new sample for the version 2 clutch. You may notice some differences if you have ordered the version 1 clutch. I love this. I know. Yeah, I think it's, I like the fact that it's wider so you can fit more stuff inside and has like that. The, 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 the zipped up pocket in the center being not there, like you can fit more stuff inside, so it's like a really capacious clutch bag. And, and it has velvet on it. I dare say it's better <laughs> than version one. Uh, it's different. It's, it's different. different. Yeah, yeah. And we, we may, we've been getting a lot of requests to do version two with spikes, so mm. we want to focus on this little baby now, but perhaps yeah. we'll change it up and do a version three. It might even look a bit weird with the spikes on because it's wider. I, I know, know. I, I think, thought about that. You I know think it's sweet. You know what I thought about? Adding two rows of spikes. Oh my gosh. Mm. That's a bit flash. But I mean, like the wallet would fit in here, right? It does. Actually, I like I'm using this, people. I actually have been using the Black Friday handbag, which I uh -huh. love. It's really, really cool. You're so, you're so good at designing things. Oh, thank you. I love the red. I'm in love with the red. Mm. Oh, the, yes. Like the shade of the oh, red. I know. Mm. It's like, it's really bright. Yeah, it's gorgeous. And oh, there's the wallet. Yeah, so it does fit so much better in and this they, one. They match like exactly. Yeah, they're so cute. It's I like just, a... <laughs> it's really cool. It's like if I was gonna, you know, have my name on any product, I'm glad it's something this awesome. Mm -hmm. <laughs> really, it's really, it's really cool. It's very stylish. Thank you. Every time I tap carry the clutch bag around, I get compliments on it. I'm like, oh, that's cool. <laughs> yeah. How do you say that? Because. This is always a funny conversation, like mm. I've had that happen too, where I take it out and people are like, oh wow, I like your bag, where did you get it from? And then I need to say, well, it's actually mine. Well, actually, I designed it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but they misunderstand me and they're like, yeah, you fucking idiot, I know it's yours, where did you get it from? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's a super confusing conversation. I just say, oh, thank you, I designed it. Well, I don't know, I wish I could say something like that. <laughs> well, <laughs> that never have designed it, so. Oh, uh, no, yeah, I, I give you all the credit. I, I just said I like these things and you made something amazing looking out of that. I like yes. the, the different strap actually. Yeah, so this one can be worn um, shorter. I don't think I've done the video on my channel yet for this no? this bag yet, so this might be part of it. But yeah, you can wear it like a shorter shoulder bag or you can totally like wear it crossbody and undo the chain and wear it long like the first one, but that's flash. Yeah, it's really nice. It's really cool. <laughs> it's our baby. Oh, it is. It's our love child. Uh, actually, I know, I've never liked the word love child. I, I much prefer bastard. Oh, it's a <laughs> bastard. <laughs> yeah, you need a bastard. British accent to get away with that bastard. one. This is a bastard wallet. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, for this bastard, we've had 320 <laughs> pre orders. I know. Thank it's, you, bastards. <laughs> I mean, it's really exciting. It is. Then they will come to being in the world sooner. Yeah. Mm. I thought this fan isn't too like, no, annoying or distracting. But it, it is very balmy here in Australia. These are due to be finished manufacturing at the end of April, so it's probably going to take three weeks for me to get them after that because they have to be sent to me and then they've got to get through customs and everything. So I estimate they will start to ship to customers sometime in May, so I will keep you all updated with that. That's worth waiting for. Definitely. Yeah, but like, so it's a shame there's like, you know, so there's no way to sort of speed up the process or something. It's just at the mercy of 
you know, the, 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 the big companies. And yeah, stuff. I'm just, yeah, I'm so grateful that like everyone has understood the pre-order process and like 99.9% .9 of people that have ordered it from my website mm -hmm. have been really understanding and patient. And yeah, it's a lot of money, like it's, we're looking at like 20 grand. To get 500 of those, what? like I don't have 20 grand in my pocket, do you? Yeah, I wish I did. Yeah, me I too. I'd love to have that. <laughs> <laughs> it sells them all bags, maybe we will. <laughs> so I wanted to talk to you, I've got a few ideas about okay. like some really different collaborations. Okay. Like so have to, to change it up a little bit. Yeah, let's get <laughs> a drink. Oh. Oh. Mm. So people are expecting like bags and stuff, mm. but I'm like, We've done the most epic handbag. Like, <laughs> what? Where? Cool. Where else can we go from there? There's nowhere to go. So, another thing, because I've got something in mind myself, which I think would be pretty cool for you. Okay. A pair of sunglasses. <gasps> oh my gosh! <laughs> now that's a cool idea. Shit. I want to take like a page <laughs> out of another brand's um, book. I'll link it later. I can't remember. Anyway, I bought a pair of sunglasses. And they came in a coffin-shaped case. Ooh, cool! And yeah, like obviously they've done it first. That's fine. Yeah. I totally say, hey, this case is inspired by them. I saw them do it because mm -hmm. I don't like, you know, just stealing an idea oh, yeah. and like, claiming it as my own. Things come in coffin-shaped cases. Yes, yeah. that's true. But ours would have to be red and black. But Ooh. yeah, a pair mm -hmm. of sunglasses. I don't want to give away my ideas, but I'm gonna whisper some shit to Freya. Okay. So you guys can't think yet. Ooh, like here and here. Oh, that sounds cool. That sounds pretty stylish. That sounds yeah. nice. Yeah. Oh my, oh my gosh. That, that's, such a, that's such a great idea. You guys didn't hear that, I heard. But what do, what do you like in sunglasses? Big. <laughs> big and, uh, uh, yeah, I mean, less than mine thing. Really big. Like, uh, <clears throat> I like the sort of cat eye ones, and mm. also there's like big sort of movie star sunglasses. Yeah. Yeah, not nothing too silly, but yeah. Like, yeah, classy, but different. Exactly. Classy, but a little bit like cute, but also classy and mysterious. Okay. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> I'll have that for you tomorrow. I have something in my head already. I actually had a dream about it. And okay. Yeah, I posted it on Instagram. I did like a, a live Instagram with you guys and said, I've got to design a pair of sunglasses because I had a dream last night and yeah, the clearest day they're in my head. Oh my um, gosh. And that's what I said to you. Yes, I had a dream. <laughs> but the case I think would be really cool. So that would be something really special. That sound, that's such a good idea. And different from a bag, I don't think people would be expecting that. Another thing, I don't, I don't know if I can do this, mm -hmm. but a really, really stylish cropped leather jacket. Oh my gosh. With studs with a blood red interior. Holy because shit. no fucking one has the red inside and if they do it's not the right shade of red. That's true. It sucks. Yeah, you're right. Faux um, leather, obviously. Do you like leather jackets? I do. I have one but it's a little bit too small. <laughs> Welcome to my life. Look, look what happened. My oh, jacket was what? Yeah. Yeah. I've got like a cropped three quarter leather jacket with me, but this, uh, the arms are so tight. Like when I move my arm, I got that. Holy shit! Yeah. Damn, that's bad. That is bad. Yeah, like so. Yeah, I don't. I can't. I can't wear mine. I'm, I'm like maybe one day I'll lose enough weight and I can like put it on. It just looks really nice on the hanger. So it would be nice to have one to actually wear. <laughs> so do you have that's a cool idea. Yeah. Any features that you really like? Like, do you wear them open or do you like to be able to do them up? <clears throat> I usually do them up and like uh, I guess. Uh, I've got a couple of sort of cropped jackets, one PVC and one velvet, obviously velvet, <laughs> PVC and velvet, who knew that those were my favourite things, uh, yeah, and like, you know, just have like a belt around the bottom or something that sort of sits nicely on the waist mm. for, the, for the shape. Mm. Something that like really accentuates the boobs, like yeah, some something, that, something, something saucy. <laughs> saucy, but yeah, like done up here, like with a big buckle, like a, a yeah, normal just big big flat on the waist, make the, make the boobs look <laughs> nice and the shoulders like feminine, I suppose, would be the, would be how I would do a jacket. <laughs> yes, gosh, you've got so many ideas. Would you want to put like something on the back? Like I've seen a lot oh. of cool style stuff, you know, and they've put like, we can do prints or studs. Yeah, gosh, well, that could, like, you, you could get so creative. Yeah, that like, really um, take some thinking about. It would, but our beloved um, like sigil of Lucifer. Something really cool that, that you don't see so everywhere. Cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. For yeah. Now, the actual jacket. That label is very important to me. Yeah. It's Worship the devil. Well. <laughs> <laughs> no. Do you get that a lot though? Uh, yes. 
I do not worship the devil. I do not believe in the existence of a devil. But you know what? More people are ordering the handbag with the sigil mm -hmm. than without. Good. It's a positive symbol. It's a good symbol. It, it, it means good things. I think it's just misunderstood. Mm. I think people are like, you know, they're afraid. They're like, oh, I don't know. It's, you know, I'm not everyone likes occult stuff. It's not so everyone. Yeah. No. <laughs> but that one, that one's a good symbol. Oh, the other thing was the little compact. Oh, yes. Yeah. Like a mirror or something. Yes. Now that's, I think that would be really, really useful. It's something you use every day. Yeah, and it's something that people that maybe they can't afford the bag. Like I know you've got a lot of um, younger like yeah. people as well, like yeah. girls, guys, whatever. Yeah. That. yeah, they're not they're not cheap, you know, because they're they're a bit fancy. fancy. But like a little a little makeup compact. Yeah, like I've had this Hello Kitty one since I was maybe sixteen. Oh my gosh, I love it. It's pretty. It's lasted a while. Yeah, Stone Monty's missing, oh. but I just adore it. It's it's really good quality. It's solid. Um, so the two things, like I haven't designed this yet, but I was thinking either coffin shaped or like a bat or a half bat. So when you open oh, it up, it's like wings. Yeah. Oh it, you get the two wings. That could be cute. Oh, this is so exciting. Oh my god. Yeah, <laughs> it's just like, we're talking about Black Friday products. Oh my god. <laughs> what are you more excited about? Like a, Let's check have we, it. Have we, can we have too many bats? Like themed stuff? Can, no. can, can you do that? <laughs> or no. should, should we go coffins? Or mm. you want to stick with the bat? Mm hmm. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. Well, think about it. Yes. One of the things I've, I've found is, you know, people are always trying to say, you know, what is it that sort of really holds the goth community together around the world? Like, try and find anyone who doesn't like bats. Everyone likes bats. <laughs> and it's a symbol of like the subculture, isn't it? Like creature it of the night, you it's know. It's sort of a Dracula. little sweet, friendly creature that just oh, so hangs out at night and some of them drink blood. Whatever. I don't know. Not like that. But you know, everybody, everybody likes that. You know, not everyone's into like certain styles or certain music or whatever. That all very much varies, but everybody likes that. <laughs> okay, that's it is. Huh. Would you want it to be silver with like little like that, pretty much? Hmm. Or do you want to go like matte? Black or something different. Black sounds nice. Yeah. I guess matte black is a little bit better than shiny, or is it? I don't know. I think matte black with like, like the debossed gloss uh -huh. could be cool. Like, yeah. you know, there might be eyes or yeah. like the details and the wings or something. Like I do that. not have the mind of a designer. Just like, oh, I don't know. Like, just can't like imagine really what things would look like. <laughs> you get these ideas, I'm like, I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it would be so funny, and I mean this in the sweetest way. Like, you and me thinking about the same product right now. For you, I see like three blobs, uh -huh. like a black blob, a lighter black blob, <laughs> and a, a grey blob. And me, uh -huh. I've got like this elaborate like Photoshop plan of a bat mirror. <laughs> You're like, yeah, that looks great. Yeah, I'm just like, <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, yeah. yeah they, they Maybe imagine that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and then you're like, yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. And every time you suggest something, it's like, oh, this, the other sounds good. Oh, but how about this? Oh, that could be good. That's good too. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I like that you're easygoing. Uh, yeah, I'm not. I'm, 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 I guess I'm, I'm not difficult. I hope. <laughs> no, not at all. Like, you've probably been the easy. Like, not that anyone I've worked with has been difficult, but um, you've stepped back a lot. Not in a way that you're uninterested, but just in a way that. I trust you. Exactly. Like I know you're, you're, you're good at it. Decisions. You're really good at it. And every time you've come up with something, I've been impressed. Yeah. yeah like uh, I've seen it, like the other things you've been designing. I'm just like, damn, these are really good. Oh, really, really good. And I'm, I just can't. I can't do that sort of thing. So respect. <laughs> respect. <laughs> respect. <laughs> Let's have a nugget. Oh, I'm looking forward to some airplane food later. Oh yeah. <laughs> Where has the day gone? <laughs> I think we slipped it away. <laughs> But not even wasn't even that long. Oh my god. Oh. I know, yeah. We took an hour and a half nap prior to filming. Time flies when you're having fun. Mm. Yeah, end of the year again. Thanks for giving me something to do. That's alright. <laughs> some some nice way to spend spend my brief visit in Sydney. Yes, did you like it? I mean I'll show you a photo of the opera house. Okay. Oh I saw it from the plane. Oh there you go. Oh my god, so this is a famous landmark. Yeah. That was pretty exciting. There goes. Whoop. <laughs> We're just right sitting there. here and phew, there's planes like coming literally. They're like right, right there. Yeah. <laughs> there they are. Wow. This giant flying machine. Yeah. <laughs> That's something I love about your channel though. Like I, I feel like I'm travelling the world or at least Europe through you. Oh yeah. Well, that's you're nice. Introducing us to so many different things. Yeah, I like to feel like you know taking someone along on a trip, <laughs> sort of like show things. I wish I could be better at it, you know, like if a 
I yeah, I mean, you're, you're pretty sucky at it with like half a million. Oh, uh, no, well, I mean, subs, you oh know, if I, if I could make vlogs as good as Casey Neistat or something with like drones and all kinds of fancy equipment, oh, that'd be really Some cool. People do that. They do. I mean, for, for like these great kind of establishing, like sweeping establishing shots of like the city that you're in or something, or yeah. the street, or yeah, you could be so much more creative. But I've got a stick and uh, one camera and like a little tiny tripod that I can kind of stick to things. Well, you know. Oh yeah, I have one of those. They're super handy. Well, They're really handy. You're doing a great job for what you have. Oh, thank you. And I don't think she like congratulates herself enough. Uh, well, I feel like because it, it could be better. It could, well, hopefully it will be, but like, uh, yeah, I know that like, I could do better. So I'm like, oh, I think it's like they're okay. I think the videos are like, they're okay, but I know that they, they could, I could do better. Yeah. Mm, I so. think that's important. Isn't that noisy? It's <laughs> that's noisy. my drone outside. <laughs> I think it's important to not feel like what you're doing is like the is all and end all because then we stop like developing as people. That's know, so. exactly right. If you think what you're doing is already perfect, then you don't try and get better. She just said that so much better than I did. Oh. <laughs> that was great. No. I'm gonna edit out what I said and just leave him with no. it. <laughs> Alright, we have to like swap cameras now. We're gonna film a little video for her channel, which will be a bit of chit chatting. For... Yeah, talk about this bag. Thank you again to everyone that has purchased something. For everybody who's like ordered one of these things, you know, I hope they reach you safely and I hope that you love them as much as we do. Alright, I will see you guys soon. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Head on over to this lovely lady's channel if you're not already. Alright, we'll see you guys soon. Bye. Bye. Have a good day. Bye. <laughs>